moving forward against Jap countermeasures means knowing all the tricks the enemy has up his sleeve. Every once in a while, concealed Jap tanks pin us down. So one of the jobs of ordnance behind the line of fire is the immediate study of captured enemy weapons. On the Burma frontier, the first captured Jap tank to be put into working order is rushed back to Imphal, India. There, ordnance studies it to tell the boys at the front how to knock it out. This tank holds three men, Japanese size, and mounts a 37 caliber plus two 30 caliber machine guns. It has several good points. It's highly maneuverable for a quick right or left turn. And it can get along very well over ditches, trenches, and rough terrain. Notice how low the wheels go down in the ditch. If you don't want a crease in your helmet, dig your foxhole good and deep. But she's got weak points and can be made defenseless. It's vulnerable at all times. From a distance, it can be put out of commission with a rifle. Here's how. This is the rear idler and track. The wheel is held by only a single bracket. And a well-placed bullet can throw the track off the bogies by breaking this bracket. Thus stopping the tank dead in its tracks. Make a note of these weak spots the pistol ports and slits, the eyes of the tank when under fire. A splatter of machine gun fire can put out the eyes. Inside these ventilator hatches is the heart of the tank, the engine. Machine gun fire will knock it out. The ventilators are also vulnerable to close quarter attack with hand grenades and incendiaries. Under this hatch is the oiling system, fuel supply and batteries extremely vulnerable at close quarters. This is the best spot to set the tank afire, an ideal target for a Molotov cocktail. The turret is hand-operated, but there's a gap between the turret and the hull, and if anything is wedged between the two parts, the turret is useless. A canteen, a rock, or your bayonet will do the trick. Ordnance tried this tank out to compare its speed with our own. The course was four-tenths of a mile. The American tank, the one furthest from the camera, quickly forges ahead and rapidly increases the lead. The finish line. Time for our tank, 50 seconds. Jap tank, 55 seconds. Our tank, 10% faster. A pretty good tank, but not so tough against the soldiers who have taken time to learn the weapons of the enemy.